My name is Glenn Josselson. I was born in Johannesburg in 1971. I currently reside in an area called Parkhurst. My mom's been a great influence and a mentor to me all my life. She's a well-known artist. She paints on silk. Since an early age, I've always dabbled in the art room while she's been painting and she's always given me advice. Painting for me is a way in which I express myself. It's a form of meditation. You know, I, I lose myself when I paint. I don't sit down at a canvas and say, listen, this is what I'm going to do today. I just get down and do it. It's, it's a way in which it's very therapeutic for me. I just am passionate about painting and it's just a form of release, I guess. I've had several art exhibitions and I think a lot of people have taken to my new concept, my new drip techniques, have been quite a success and quite a hit. My inspirations come from my photography, my travels. I love taking photos and a lot of my art comes from places I've been to. I love taking pictures of static things, things in motion, people, places. I even have dabbled in taking photos around scrapyards. Jackson Pollock is one of my biggest influences. Miro, Picasso definitely. You know, most of my new techniques that I've put together or developed for myself come from Jackson Pollock. I love the way he applies paint. Very free, very wild. A lot of my inspiration definitely comes from African art. The walls of the huts I definitely relate to it and a lot of my inspiration definitely comes from the continuity and the, and the colours. I love the colours in which they've used. I love travelling and I love seeing new cultures. I've been to Greece recently. The amount of photos I took in Greece are definitely going to be a major contributing factor to my, my new artworks, my up and coming artworks. My main line of work basically does incorporate my art, it's interior design. I renovate houses and apartments and I basically gut them. I take the shell and I start from scratch. I also incorporate new with the old, so I'll take an old home, restore it, but I'd put new kitchens, new bathrooms in, and that's very indicative of the current home I'm living in in Parkhurst. I love stone, I love sandstone, I love travertine, I love uh, the new kinds of stones we get nowadays, slate. I follow the trends and basically I go with the flow and what people like. 